So then what would you like to do when you grow up? My intention is to be a pilot, but that's only for before. Now I think being a pilot is too tiring since my dad is a pilot and he barely has time to spend with me. Okay. I want to open <laughs> shop that where customers can fish crayfish. So before I went to that kind of shop in Shanghai and I thought it's quite interesting. However, the cons about that is me me having to stay in that shop for hours. Okay. Then why would you like to open that kind of shop? Because I think it would be worth a lot. And I went to Vietnam and I thought there is a place where that is very crowded and then you can open a shop and then get a lot of money from it. So my friend's dad has a good relationship there and I wanted to use that relationship to open a my own crayfish shop and I think it would be worth a lot of money. If you are going to abandon island or by yourself with nobody else, but you can just bring three things with you. And which three things would like to bring to this forgotten island? No matter how big or how small. Yeah, regardless of that. I would bring my house. Okay. So yeah. I can live there. Yeah. And also, I think Just in case, mm -hmm. I would bring some kind of device that I could ask for help. Also, I would probably bring my friends. Okay, well, it's a very good idea. So, we could have a spend time together and it wouldn't be lonely for me. Yeah, it's good. So, would you mind just tell me something that you learned, you've learned at school that have changed the way you look at the world? For example, when you're opening maybe a bottle of Coke, you would use a chopstick to put it under the thing you click it with and then open the Coke so it would be easier for you. And I would put it to life sometimes. Hmm. Fantastic. I think it's um, some knowledge learned from Felix. Yes. Yes. It's Science. Science. It's good.